Hey everyone, this is Sal Congeloso from Geek.com and I'm here with Alienware's new M17X. This is the newest model and the company's current flagship. And we did an unboxing and the full review is going up live shortly. So I wanted to do a quick look at the lighting. So I know this is something that interests a lot of people. And while looking at the lighting, we'll get a look at the exterior as well. So right now the system is in hibernation mode. I just uh, closed the lid with Vista on, Windows on, and you can see the alien head itself is going in and out. Let's take a closer look. Uh, it's not the normal color, it's the yellow, which means it's hibernating, so I normally have a purple. So there you go, and that's the only light on in this system. Take a look, quick look at the front, and then, uh, yeah, you can see nothing's on. And then uh, what we'll do is plug it in. Uh, this is the power connection right here. You can see it has a persistent blue LED shining in there. Uh, Dell does this with a couple of their notebooks, adapters. So uh, we'll plug that in and we'll get going. The system is plugged in and it uh, shifts over to a purple, which is my standard color and the pulsing stops, which means it's not running off battery, battery power, and it's charging. Open it up. Heard the fan go on there, and now you can see my color scheme. This is on nice and quick. And just to give you a quick look at uh, what I did here, you can see I have purple on the back and then we have purple for the Alienware logo then we have green yellow blue across the made keyboard zone then we have red or uh, sorry it's an orange on the keypad blue on the touch sensitive area purple on the Alienware head purple on the logo actually that may be orange nope it's purple and then we have orange over here and the grills, which I will tilt up, are green. And windows, windows freaked out, so we back. Okay, windows is cooperating with us now, so we hopped into the Alien Command Center and specifically the Alien FX, which is where you control the lighting zones. And uh, this is uh, software we've seen before. It's just a little bit more robust on the M17X, which you have additional zones, including the three zone keyboard, or four zone if you want to count the number pad. And uh, try not to get in the way here. What you do is basically you kick, click a zone. I'll pick keyboard one, which is the leftmost area. It's uh, kind of a green now, shifted it over to purple or blue or whatever that was hit apply and it shifts. So uh, I'll go back to my green and then uh, we'll change say the logo. That might be easier to see. We'll change that over to a red. Some of the tones are hard to differentiate differentiate from one another because there's a like a dark purple, a medium purple, a pink, and then a, I don't know what a fuchsia. They're hard to tell from each other. Over here we have two different reds, hard to tell these oranges. Anyway, so you can customize to your liking, but you will have to, uh, you know, find what you like and uh, customize it. You could shut all the lights off and do whatever you want. Uh, the, what, what I meant before is that the uh, on camera, it can be tough to tell an orange from a different orange. And I uh, just go back to that logo and I'll shift it over something a little bit better. I don't love the red there. So this is a the medium purple. And this is the dark purple. And now we're going to shift back to the medium purple. It's a really slight change. It actually looks like the LED in the back just gets a little bit brighter for that one. And let's go over to this light blue. Yeah, it's almost more of a greenish, but you get the idea. 
So now, the last thing we want to do is look at the stealth mode. That is sh function F7, for people that don't know. And what this is going to do, most importantly, is shift between discrete and integrated graphics. It's uh, Alien builds it, Alienware builds it as a power saving feature. Uh, to do it, they want us to close the application. Sure thing, you're supposed to do that, all the applications closed, that's not a big deal. And I'll close Steam down and function F7. Shift in into stealth mode, but the... Okay, now it's shift into stealth mode. And there you go, you can see that the lighting isn't affected, so it's not completely stealth, but uh, big picture, uh, it's talking about power usage and the it's plugged in, so it's really not a big deal. Anyway, that's the, that's the stealth mode, we'll switch back. I did want to show that off on the hardware front because it's really cool and it's one of the better features of a system like this. And it's shifting back, there you go. And what, what happens now is we'll have, we went from the dual 280M graphics cards to the 9400 and back to the 280s. So yeah, that's the Alienware M17X gaming notebook and we have a quick tour of the lighting. How cool is that? And you probably don't even like my color scheme. It looks a little bit cooler when you have uh, one single color. Or some people are going to think so. I like the, the kind of clown suit rainbow of it, but who knows. Anyway, this is Sal Congeloso from Geek.com. Thanks for watching.